Welcome to Vintage SF. I'm Richard Rempel. Today, we're going to take a look at the best of SF masterworks. This is what you might call a sub-series of the SF masterworks. At the time of making this video, there are now 21 best of SF masterworks. They have a promotional line which reads, Welcome to the best of the masterworks, a selection of the finest in science fiction. Now, how are the best of the SF Masterworks selected? I don't know. I couldn't find any information on that. I don't know if it's based on sales or if it's based on an editor choice. In this video, I'll show you some online resources. I have a spreadsheet that I've created for this that I will be able to share with you. And I also have a slideshow of all the covers of the best of SF Masterworks. So let's get started. The Best of SF Masterworks doesn't really have a logo that says the best of. This is the logo that you can find on the covers of all the books. It's a more minimalist design of graphics. In fact, the graphics for the whole series seems to be a little bit more minimalist. One of the best resources online to keep track of the Masterworks collection is Wikipedia. Just look up SF Masterworks. In there, they have listed all the best of Masterworks collection that has been printed from 2020 to the present. We start with the soft covers, first issued October 27th, 2022. And as you can see, there is later publication dates. They usually publish about four or five books at a time. And then we have the hard covers from 2022 to present as well. There's just two of them, October 27th, 2022 and August 24th of 2023. These hardcovers are laminated boards and as opposed to the yellow color of the SF Best of Masterworks, these are red. My understanding from the SF Masterworks is that Golang sometimes doesn't have the printing right to the paperback issues. In that case, they print a hardcover. Next, we're going to take a look at ISFDB, Internet Science Fiction Database, for some details. As you can see, similar to Wikipedia, we have the date of publication, the title, author, publisher, ISBN, and catalog ID. We also have the price, pages, and the format. Here you can see that the entire series has the same cover artist, Atun Purser. Atun Purser is a deep sea ecologist and illustrator. You can take a look at some of his work on his website. On November 19th, 2022, he shared that his artwork was gracing the covers of the best of sci-fi masterworks. The ongoing Golang series of sci-fi masterworks has kept many obscure and great works of science fiction in print. I am glad to say I have been working with Golang's Orion for a number of months on illustrating their The Best of the Sci-Fi Masterworks range of new paperbacks. By December 8th, 11 paperbacks will be in the shops, as well as a hardback edition of Dune. This art helps unify this sub-series of the SF Masterworks. His art reminds me of some graphic novel art that I've seen. All the books are novels within this series. Here's a look at the spreadsheet that I've created for the best of SF Masterworks. There are 21 books in the series. Let's take a closer look at one of the books now. I have Sarah Canary by Karen Joy Fowler, 1991. I'm not sure if you can see, but there's sort of a shiny portion on the font and on the moon here as well. There's sort of a window for the artwork by Otan Purser. And there you can see, this is the logo or the iconography for this series. It's a solid, deeper yellow. On the spine, we see SF over here at the top, and we see Victor Golank's iconography at the bottom. It is solid yellow all the way around. In previous versions, we've had quadrants or columns for this information. Now we simply have it with dividers. So at the top, it says, Welcome to the Best of the Masterworks, a selection of the finest in science fiction. Then we have a blurb for the novel, a bio, 
and some testimonials. It is a B-size format which matches the SF Masterworks. Next, I have a slideshow of the covers for the series. I have them in alphabetical order by the author's last name. If you want to learn more about SF Masterworks and see some of the reviews I have for some of the books, go to my channel page, Vintage SF. There you'll find my playlist for the SF Masterworks, including this video. And if you're interested in a spreadsheet or using it as a checklist, you can go to my webpage, VintageSF.ca. That's for Canada. I have a post that has spreadsheets for all the SF Masterworks. There's a link to the post in the description for this video, and I'll also pin a comment with that link. What do you think of the best of SF Masterworks? Do you think it's necessary? Let me know in the comments below. Until next time, keep collecting and keep reading.